Hello everyone, I'm John Atkinson. And I'm Martin Locke. Uh, we're from Fiserv. Fiserv is the world's leading provider of digital banking and payment solutions. Today, we want to showcase our point-of-sale experience of the future. Because regardless of who wins in the mobile payment space, banks need to ensure that they remain top of mind and top of wallet amongst their consumers. To do this, they have to not focus on the payment itself, but rather the value and the services that uh, form part of the payment experience. So um, banks are pretty well placed to do this because there's uh, an increasing level of sophistication of technology and features available in smartphone and other devices that are coming to market. Um, so they will need to uh, use some of the inherent capabilities of those devices to enhance the customer experience. Things like what we're going to be using today on the iPhone 6, biometric authentication, location services, and camera capabilities. OK, so we are going to be using our fictitious banking brand, Genius, for this demonstration, um, because mobility is a white label solution. And the scenario I want to uh, present today is that Martin here is at the airport, um, ready to go abroad. As you can see, he's one of the more active members of the human race. Um, and he is an avid extreme sports fan. So whilst he's at the airport, he decides he wants to buy himself a GoPro camera. So Martin knows that his bank provides um, various options from uh, various offers from merchants. So he decides that he's going to log into his mobile banking app. Now, because Martin is uh, constantly a man on the go, um, and unfortunately has fingers like a bunch of bananas, he decides that he's going to log into his mobile app using his fingerprint, something that he configured in the app earlier. By doing this, he will be presented with uh, the digital services that are available in the mobility platform, and on this occasion, he's going to choose Discover My Offers. By doing this, he'll be presented with a map of his location and the offers that are customized for Martin um, with all the offers in his vicinity. He picks up the phone and he pans it around to get an augmented reality depiction of the offers that are available to him. Hey, John, as luck would have it, I've got one at World Duty Free. I think I'm going to pop in there for the GoPro. Great. So Martin based, uh, taps on to see the details associated with that offer and activates the offer for use in the store. He goes into the World Duty Free shop and um, goes and chooses the GoPro camera he wants and decides that he's going to use, on this occasion, Apple Pay to pay for the, the camera. So he does that by simply tapping the phone on the reader and uh, using his fingerprint once again to authorize the payment. There we go, the, the payment is complete. Now Martin will receive a, an alert informing him that he's just made that purchase. Uh, this is an alert delivered by the Mobility uh, Enterprise Alerts Engine, um, something that is um, available in our product and deployed by many banks as part of the overall here's product. The alert, John. And here's the alert. So the alerts come through. Martin opens the alert because it's an actionable push notification. This time, when he authenticates to go into the mobile app, he will go directly to the transaction detail. From here, he's going to have a variety of options available to him. And one of those is actually to take a picture of the receipt that's associated with the purchase. This will allow him to have a visible record of the, uh, the transaction that he's just made. Sit. So now he's got a, a record um, to, to show what he spent the money on. Now, Martin knows that because he's the extreme sports athlete that he is, that basically his GoPro camera needs some insurance. So he wants to check whether he can uh, have his GoPro camera covered by his travel insurance. So he taps to make an insurance inquiry. This time he's stepped up to uh, provide a password to start a secure and contextual live chat session with a call center representative. Martin, we're not going to show you that right now. We'll show you at our booth later. But in essence, what that would do is give the CSR 
the, the context of what Martin is inquiring about, and he would actually be able to uh, attach the receipt and send the receipt to the CSR during that live chat session. So I exit the shop because my flight's been called. Uh, I'm in a rush to get there. Um, and what I don't want to do is to have harassing bank phone calls uh, asking me for numerous authentication whilst I'm away. So if I go on to manage my cards, uh, I can switch to my profile, which is traveling internationally. It will allow me to manage my card. So I can travel internationally to let my bank know that I'm traveling abroad and whilst allowing pre-arranged payments whilst uh, from home like uh, bills. Um, it also allows me to be notified of any fraud that's happening on my card whilst I'm away. Excellent. So that was a, a win for Martin and a win for the bank because he hasn't uh, had to make any lengthy phone calls, particularly from abroad, which would cost him a lot of money. So what have we seen here today? Well, we've seen uh, Martin using augmented reality to uh, basically get a, a list of his offers and to activate those offers. We've seen him making a payment using Apple Pay, but it could have been any mobile payment, including a card payment. We saw him alert, alerted by the fact that he got the payment with a actionable push notification. We saw him attaching a receipt to the transaction, starting a live chat session with a CSR, and being able to, um, uh, to manage his preferences on his card. So this shows that we've got the depth breadth and innovative thinking to make FISA a part, perfect partner for your organization. Thank you. Please come and see us at a booth.